The two lists that we're going to compare right now, list 1, will have the numbers 6, 8, and 2. 6, 8, and 2. And for list 2, we will have 9, 5, and 4. What we're going to compare is 6 from list 1 and 5 from list 2. So step 1 is to find the mean for list 1. So add them up to get 6, 8 is 14, 2 is 16, 16 divided by 3, rounded to the tenths place, is 5.3 for the average. We'll go ahead and do the average for list 2. 9 and 5 is 14, plus 4 is 18, divided by 3 is 6. The standard deviation for list 1 would be 6 minus 5.3, square that, 8 minus 5.3, square that, and 2 minus 5.3 square that. Divide everything by 3 and find the square root. List 1 standard deviation is 2.5. Now list 2 standard deviation uh, that would be 9 minus 6 square it, 5 minus 6 square it, and 4 minus 6 square that. Divide it all by 3, square root of that answer. Standard deviation of list 2 is 2.2. Alright, the z-score for list 1, item 6. So list 1, item 6, z-score, is going to be the item minus the mean divided by the standard deviation. 0 0.28 and then list 2 item 5 the z-score is going to be uh, 5 minus 6 and then divide by 2.2 negative 0 0.45 now compare these two numbers which one is the highest one yeah, so list 1, item 6 would have the better performance over list 2, item 5. Alright, in this practice problem, list 1 is 5, 9, and 1. List 2 is 6, 11, and 1. What we're going to compare is 9 from list 1 and 11 from list 2. What I need you to bring up first is the average for list 1. Average is 5, and now we need the average for list 2. The average should be 6 on that. Now what we want to find is the standard deviation for list 1. For the standard deviation of list 1, you need 5 minus 5, square that, and then 9 minus 5, square that, and 1 minus 5, square that. All over 3, need the square root of everything. Standard deviation should be 3.3. 3.3 for the standard deviation of list 1. Standard deviation of list 2 is going to be the following. 6 minus 6, square that, and then 11 minus 6, square that, and 1 minus 6, square that, all over 3, and then you need the square root. Standard deviation for list 2 is 4.1. The next thing we're going to look for is the z-score for list 1. Z-score for list 1. For the Z-score of list 1, you have to have uh, the item 9 minus the mean, 5, and then divide by the standard deviation, 
of 3.3. So that would be 4 divided by 3.3, which comes out to be 1.21. Bring up the second z-score now. The z-score for number 2, uh, that would be the item 11 minus the mean 6 divided by 4.1. So we'll come up with 5 divided by 4.1, which is 1.22. The final answer for this one should be list 2 and then item 11.